Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, we are going to discuss how we can download and install Eclipse IDE on Windows 10. So the latest version of Eclipse is Eclipse IDE 2019-03. So to download, just open your favorite browser and search for Eclipse and open the link from eclipse.org slash download. Eclipse is an integrated development environment Eclipse is specially used for Java development. So this is the official website from where you can download Eclipse IDE 2019-03. Here you can see the latest version of Eclipse IDE. And here we have download option for 64-bit. So if you are using 32-bit operating system, then you cannot install Eclipse IDE 2019-03 on your computer. Before installing Eclipse IDE on your Windows 10 computer, you have to install Java JDK on your computer. So I had already made a video on how you can download and install Java JDK 12 on your computer. So the video link will be on the i button or you will get it on the description box. After downloading and installing Java JDK 12 on your computer, then only go for Eclipse IDE. So here we have the download button, just click on download 64 bit. And here we have the download button and the location from where we are downloading Eclipse ID. And here we have the file name. So let me click on download. Here you can see it is downloading Eclipse installer file which is around 14 MB. So let me complete the download. Our Eclipse installer file has been downloaded. Let us open it. Here we have the window of Eclipse installer. Let me minimize the browser. And here we have different versions of Eclipse. So you can see here we have Eclipse for Java development, C and C++, JavaScript, web development, PHP, and many more. So for now, we are just going to focus on Java development. So to download it for Java development, just click on Eclipse IDE for Java developers. This is the default installation folder where Eclipse IDE will be installed. So if you want to change the installation folder, then you can simply do it by just clicking on this folder icon and here you can select your location. For now, let me keep it at default and here click on install. And here you can see it is installing. So the installation process will take some time. Wait till the installation complete. And here we have license agreement. Just click on accept. And after that you will get a certificates window, just click on select all and click on accept selected. Our installation process has been completed, just click on launch. So here you can see Eclipse IDE 1903 and here we have to select our workspace location. So for now I will just keep it at default. If you have a good reason to change your workspace location, then simply click on this browse button and select your workspace location. For now, let me keep it at default and click on launch. Here you can see welcome to Eclipse IDE for Java developers. So let me maximize the window and let me close this welcome screen. This is the interface of Eclipse IDE. So now let me show you how you can create your first Java project using Eclipse IDE. For that, click on file, then click on new and here you will find Java project. Just click on Java project. And here you have to name your project. So let me name it as my project. After naming your project, just click on next. And here you will find the project hierarchy. So we had created my project folder. Inside this my project folder, we will get a source folder. So inside this source folder, all the source code will be saved. So let me click on finish and here we have to create module info.java file. So let me name it as my project then click on create. This will create module info.java file. So here you can see this is our project hierarchy. Now let me show you that how you can create your Java class file. To create Java file just right click on the source file, click on new and after that go to class. And here you have to name your class file. So let me name it as my Java. Let me tell you that you have to name your class file in camel case order. So here you can see 
the first letter of each word should be in capital letter and then click on public and here just click on public static void main function then click on finish now here we have my java.java .java file so let me show you how you can print hello world using java for that here just write system dot out dot print ln let me use parenthesis and between this parenthesis we have to write our string variable say for example hello world and after completing each statement we have to close that statement to close the statement just use semicolon i had already made a playlist on java so the playlist link will be on the description box or you will get it on the i button now to run the program just click on run button here you will find run my java dot java file just click on there and here select the class file then click on ok this way you can download and install eclipse ide on windows 10 so that's it for this video if you like this video don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this bye for now see you next video